Yaku Wings Incorporated is not responsible for personal or property damage suffered while utilizing Yaku Wings. Glide at your own risk. Ah, oh, there's always got to be a disclaimer. You gotta love them. Hello, everybody. Kelsey the Pyrofly here. And today I am back on the perhaps the last Minecraft adventure map. And I know it's been a really long time since I was on vacation and all, but if anybody remembers the last video, it didn't go that well. I failed pretty bad. I mean, they clearly chose the wrong person for this mission. I, like, didn't follow directions very well. And I blew some stuff up, and it just it didn't go that well. But today, I am going to attempt to redeem myself for all that and not fail. That's what we're hoping. So... I may have a book here. I don't... I think this rear guard is my most recent book. Let me just read it real quick. I'm guarding the rear of Deku in fear when the pumpkins draw near. I won't let them in here. If you've earned two tokens, then our curses might be broken. Return through the oak and let them know we've spoken. Okay, so I believe that was the last one. I think that was just my parting um, conversation with the Deku. There's basically, I think, like five tribes of trolls or something that I'm trying to help fight the heroes. And I just helped the Deku, and then one more before them. I have a token from them too, but it's all in my ender chest. I can't show you guys right now. Honestly, it's been so long, I barely even remember what I'm doing. But I'm just going to keep following this path and hope somebody will tell me what I'm supposed to be doing, because I don't remember. But usually, it's fairly self-explanatory. These people do a lot of talking, by which I mean to say they leave books. And I have to do a lot of talking, so I mess up all of the words and stuff. But... That doesn't matter because I'm going to help them, and if I mess up the words, that's just going to be the way it goes. So I don't know what tribe I'm going to encounter next, but hopefully they will like me and they won't be like this, this spider, this mean, evil spider, and the tutorials that I really don't need on the side. That's always good. But anyway, I feel like I'm getting close. I see a civilization over here. I'm just going to ignore the skeleton, ignore the haters. And also, if you remember last episode, I accidentally had it in adventure mode after the first time I cheated. And then that caused some other problems. It's supposed to be in survival, not adventure mode, so that's now fixed. As you can see, I can break stuff. Feathers and other things I'm pretty sure I don't need, but I'm going to look through anyway because I'm weird like that. Alright, so chicken and feathers, I mean, it wouldn't kill me to have a little bit of extra meat just in case. I think this is like a chicken farm or something. The chickens must die up here. And then fall down into here. Clearly that's what's going down. Then they get smelted and stuff. So it looks like this particular tribe of trolls must be very good with technology. Because they know more about redstone than I do. I'm, I'm not that good at redstoning. So we have a, another chest of more random stuff. And because I'm a hoarder, I'm going to take all of it. There's orange wool. I don't think this is the orange wool that I need. But it might be. I, I don't remember what wool I even have. So... I'm going to take this. I, I don't think it's the magical, mystical, important wool, but whatever. I'm, I'm taking it anyway. I'm getting really distracted here. Look, there's a melon farm, a cactus farm. This is the Gordomatic, courtesy Q Incorporated. I have no idea what's going on, but this is clearly some sort of farm, which I'm not going to steal from. Honestly, I probably shouldn't be taking their stuff. The, uh, the natives might not think I'm making a very good impression, so I need to probably be a little bit nicer. Unfortunately, I completely lost the path and I have no idea where I'm going, so my whole plan for redemption is looking less and less good by the second. But hey, I do see some people over here. Maybe they'll tell me what to do. And I have learned from past experience that the buttons on their faces do absolutely nothing. You don't press those. I think they might be eyes or something. But what you do is you take the books and you read them and that's how you talk to these people. So I will I will take that off your hands and we'll see what happens. But first, the ender chest. Right, so here's my wools that I need to return to the fleecy boxes. Basically what this is, is it's like a reverse CTM. We're fighting the heroes and trying to put the wool back because they were stolen and stuff like that. In the very beginning I actually stole the wool from the monument and now I'm trying to put it all back in the fleecy boxes. So we're basically playing on the team of the normal bad guys except we're the good guys. So. It's a little confusing, but we'll get the hang of it eventually. So this is the Deku Tribe Sigil. This is the Kissing Talisman that I got for helping them. And this is the shield I got from the last place. This is the Sledding Talisman that I got for helping the people before them. I forget what their name is because I'm just not that good at names. But 
that's all my stuff. It's still here. Thank goodness it didn't somehow disappear because with my luck, that would totally happen. And now I will read this book. Sacked. Greetings, courier. The assault goes well. You've been ordered to guard this gate for your arrival. If you've returned the first two wool and gained the token of the Dekud and Algid tribes, then you may enter. Okay, so the Algid tribe was the other tribe, and I have both tokens right here. Well, technically they're talismans, but I think they still count as tokens. Hopefully they'll let me enter. Oh, I probably have to put them in, don't I? All right, I got this. That's, I guess that's why they gave me three of them. I probably actually have to use some. I'm really glad I didn't just, like, take one and leave the rest because I could do that. Yeah, just take my dirt. You, you love dirt, right? You know, I, I, might, I might leave you with some other stuff that I really don't want right now. Yeah, you can, you can have all that. All that good stuff. There's something blow up that might be not great. I'd better be moving. No need to stick around too long, right? All right, what do you have to say, sir? To the tower. Well done, courier. While you return the first two wolves to the troll lads, we have taken this city. All but a few of the pumpkin heroes have retreated to the east, leaving their citizens behind to become our slaves. It is time for you to meet our leader, the uniter of the seven troll tribes. He is even now fighting his way to the top of the tower behind me. Go to him and deliver your report before continuing on to the next lair. Okay, but, um, are you sure you want to make the people slaves and all? That seems kind of mean. I mean, maybe we can negotiate this. I'm thinking... I'm thinking let them go and make the promise not to fight us anymore. That seems like a much nicer option. You think on that, all right? You think on that. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to support you making people slaves, all right? If, if you want my help, you're going to have to not do that. Thank you. All right, so what do we have here? It wouldn't hurt to look around just a tad. I mean, it's not like I'm in that much of a hurry, hopefully. Oh, how'd that get there? How'd that get there? Vanilla Federated. Parent company, Vanilla Federated. Founded 2014. Substairs, Vanilla Films. Vanilla Farms. Vanilla Frames. Vanilla Pharmacology. Vanilla Futures. Vanilla Fungi. Vanilla Flames. Vanilla Fashions. And Vanilla Friends. All right, I have no idea why that's there, and I'm pretty sure it's completely useless to me, but, you know... I feel bad throwing it away, so I'm going to just go ahead and put it right right there. All right. I have important things to be doing. He said to go find the leader and report to him. I should probably do that. Oof. Ice. Slippery. I think this guy actually fell in. Um, No, he didn't fall in. He fell over. Um, Well, I can't help you right now. Sorry. I, I, I'm very busy. Got to go. Maybe. That's interesting. This is all weird. Ah! An enemy! Halt! You trolls are giving me a migraine. Really? That's good, because, y you know, it's better than having your head chopped off, which is really tempting sometimes with you people. But since I just gave the guy back there a lecture about being nice, I'm just going to take this and leave you alone. Now don't you go causing any trouble. You hear me? You hear me? Don't. You. Do it. All right, I think he got the message. I'll just hold on to that. I think I'm actually supposed to shove it in here, which means I don't need any of this stuff, really. I don't know what I'm doing. But we got him taken care of. I see a no pumpkin sign, so apparently this we're, apparently we're in the right place. Vanilla Fashion's Catwalk. I'm putting up these banners to proclaim our victory. All right, well, I'm glad to hear that we were victorious. What's all this stuff? It's fish. I don't have time to look around at all that stuff. Yes, I can see that Q Incorporated has some very impressive technology, but this over here looks like a very... This looks castle-y. Well, actually, it looks kind of like a dump. I mean, it's made of dirt, but hopefully this is the right place. The Dirt Shack. Well, then. Dirt don't hurt. Well, I suppose, I suppose dirt's okay, but... The Dirt Shack. We sell dirt because dirt don't hurt. Regular price, one block of dirt for one block of air. Seasonal special, 64 dirt for only 10 blocks of air. Whoa! Oh my gosh, it's a sale! I'm not that interested, to be honest, though. Sorry, but I, I don't need any dirt at the moment. Okay, maybe this is the castle, right? This one looks like it's in much better condition. Um, hello, am I in the right place? I'll take a brisket and pumpkin spice latte. All right, I seem to have arrived at the cafe. Welcome to Meet and Greet DIY Meat Barbecue. All right, um, I'm thinking... I'm thinking this might not be the place yet. 
Let's see, maybe the king is over this way. I'm completely lost, aren't I? I'm never gonna find him. I'm failing already. I can't do this. Actually, it just dawned on me that maybe I should go for the biggest building. That would be this one over here. I don't know why I'm looking at all this other stuff. This one is clearly the best one. Are we allowed to cross a picket line? It's some sort of pumpkin protest. Of course we're allowed to cross it. I mean, what are they going to do to stop us? I'm a map maker, but nobody knows my name. Boycott selfish MeTubers. <laughs> Instead of YouTuber, it's MeTuber. I promise, guys, I'm not, I'm not selfish. I don't think. MeTubers don't give proper credit. I promise I'll try to credit the map. Don't guilt trip me. It's not nice. In case nobody reads the description, I might as well just let you know the map download is in the description. So any credit you need from the map, just click on that link. You can see exactly where I downloaded it and get it for yourselves. So I am crediting this map. So don't you go guilt tripping me, Mr. Pumpkin Man. Don't you do it. The Jiggerbob Memorial Building, EST 2015. MeTube International Headquarters. All right, is this the guy? This definitely looks like the guy. Top of tower. Okay, this is the map. I don't like maps. I'm not good with maps. I'm just going to hope I don't actually need to read this. They do have redstone nerds in the basement. That might be useful. All right, what's up? Lakeside Bar and Grill. Reception. Hello. Hi, and welcome to MeTube, a division of Google. I believe your leader just ran past up the stairs. My name is Glad Gladys. Ladies. All right, thank you. You said up the stairs. Which way are the stairs? Stairs, stairs, stairs. Where are the stairs? Oh, do you know where the stairs is? I hate waiting for the lift. Yeah, seriously, who wants to wait for the elevator? Let's find the stairs. So much faster. Except I don't like stairs. Here we go. I'll take a shortcut. Oh, leader, troll leader, I need you. Entree means starter. You're welcome. Oh, I guess I always wondered what that meant. I always thought it meant main course, but... Whatever, I'll take your word for it. All right, here we go. This is definitely the guy. I can feel it. Oh, shoot. It's just the guy waiting for the elevator again. I went the wrong way. Is this the guy? Why is this board blank? Eh, I have no idea. Just need to try to find this top floor. Where is the troll leader? Oh, my gosh. You are a scary looking dude. Can I get an exclusive interview for my channel? Uh, er, n n no. No, not right now, please. I'm, I'm good. I, I don't know. Just, just no. Right, where were those stairs? Get me on the stupid stairs! I think this is the top floor. Wait, maybe there's an even topper top floor? What do you think? Top floor or not the top floor? That is the question. Out of order. Out of order. Out of order. Is there any way I can actually get into the elevator, maybe? Uh, no. Wait, it's in survival mode. I can just bust it down. Take that, you stupid elevator that's taking too long. I'm going to destroy you. You know, maybe a sword isn't the best um, elevator opening tool. Hmm. Maybe I should have thought this through earlier. Whatever, it's almost done. There's no turning back now. Die, elevator, die. Oh, maybe that wasn't the right thing to do. I swear it wasn't me who sabotaged the elevator. I'm just the janitor. No. Oh. Well then. That's all right then. I'll just leave you alone. I'm going to climb up this thing. And there's nothing you could do to stop me. So don't even try. Said the guy went up the stairs, but I can't find the stairs. So I broke into the elevator. Sometimes you just have to be creative. Seriously though, I couldn't find stairs that went up high enough. But this, this just looks perfect. Look, there's even a way out. They, I must be meant to go here. I think I did the right thing. All right, there we go. We're at the very top. It's snowing. It's cold. And the troll leader is nowhere to be seen. No way, is this him? Is this the guy? Oh, it's you. He's been waiting for you. Oh, thank goodness, this is him. No one approaches the boss without his permission. 
Um, excuse me, but I have an appointment, so I suggest you get out of my way. All right, we have, oh, how great, Yaka wings. I hate these things. I hate them so much. Yaka wings instruction manual. Remove overgarment, affix Yaka wings across shoulder blades, fastening straps A and B. Whilst the Yaka mating, whistle the Yaka mating, hunting, or greeting call to direct flight as desired. Jump and while in the air, kick legs once more. Glide freely and pierce the hearts of your enemies. Yaka wings incorporated is not responsible for personal or property damage suffered while utilizing Yaka wings. Glide at your own risk. Ah, oh, there's always got to be a disclaimer. You gotta love them. All right. Your Majesty, I have arrived. I must give my report. We're doing good so far, but there's still a lot more to do. Ah, courier, look below. Wow, that's a lot of stuff. All that we survey is now firmly in troll hands. My hands. But soon the seven tribes will again be at each other's throats. We will disperse back to our lairs and once again be vulnerable. Pumpkin men, melon men, Beetroot men, all would pose a threat to our sacred wool. But I, Yondu, have a greater vision. We must install a wool here in this city and make it this our capital. From here, I, Yondu, will keep the tribes united. Do you see that building below with the large blue circle thing on its roof? That is the last building we have been unable to breach. Its defenses are strong. That is where we shall hide our orange wool. Take these wings, courier, affix them to your back, and when I whistle, they will fly you down to the rooftop. Gain entry and search its interior. Do this, and I will elevate your rank from Payone to Ravager. Go. Oh, so Payone's not actually my name. That's like, that's just my rank. Got it. It's probably like the lowest one, too. Honestly, though, I think if, if, if he'd known everything, it's a good thing I didn't tell him everything, because if he'd known everything, I probably would have had a much lower rank. I mean, let's be honest here. I haven't been doing so good. But I'm going to redeem myself today, I think. Right. Blue circly thing. Here we go! Oh! Darn it! Ouchie! That hurt. Oh, okay. That did not go very well. All right, I'm not gonna fail again. Here we go! Woo! Ouch. Why is this so hard? All right, what are we on now? Like the sixth try? Okay, come on, just don't hit the ground. Oh my gosh, I made it! Yes, thank goodness. I'm never doing that again. I hate those wings. Yondu sent me down to assist you. This should do the trick. Oh, oh, maybe I should have been more careful. Okay, it's all good. Guess I had to get into the building somehow. I do have some orange wool on me. Technically, it's not the wool, but I acquired it somewhere else. So, you know, if I, if worse comes to worse, I have a backup wool. They probably won't notice anything's amiss for a while. Anyway. Hmm. Ice cold water. Refreshing. Ooh, can I have some? <laughs> Just kidding. But seriously, never lick, never lick frozen things. It's, it's not a good idea. Anyway, I gotta get in here and find the uh, fleecy box and put my orange wool back where it belongs. Let's see, boss battle branch and escape branch. I'm thinking this is clearly the way to go first. Behold my complex swordsmanship. Swordsmanship. <laughs> my complex swordsmanship. That's, oh my gosh, that's just, that's just weird. Okay. Um, oh really? Well, behold my complex sword. Behold its glory. And don't even try to take it from me or you'll regret it, punk. All right. Resecure all weights and resistance bands to their racks. Um, all right. This is apparently the, um, the exercise room. This is the gym. I'm not, I'm not much of a gym person myself, so I think I'll pass on that. You, you have fun in there. You know what? Just, just, just work out. Have, have fun with that and don't, don't bother me. Escape branch. Perfect. All right. What's in here? I've released all my students. Please let me live. All right. All right. I'm not that mean. I'm, I'm not, I'm not going to hurt you, dude. 
just uh don't don't tell anybody I was here, all right? Yeah, okay, good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. This is Arena Branch. Hopefully I don't have to go there. How about this? That's the drinking fountain again. I have no idea where I'm going. All right, I guess we're going to the Arena Branch. Maybe that's where they store the fleecy box. All right. Mur, uh, a troll. Do you have an appointment? Um, yeah, totally. I've, I've always got an appointment. Yeah. Appointment. Right. Definitely. Um, I've got an appointment with, uh, the orange fleecy box right about... Ah, now. So, you better let me go or else. Right, I'm just gonna take care of that. Dropper branch. Adventure branch, please never... Oh, why am I even going there? I'm so horrified to have to look at this. Oh, thank goodness, it's just a toilet. Phew. Oh my gosh, I was afraid there was going to be an actual dropper in here. It's just the bathroom. That's very strange. Adventure branch. Okay, I see a library. Okay, I'm not seeing the fleecy box branch, though, so that's concerning. Um, how about this one? Office of Branch Manager. Yes, this sounds perfect. Welcome, trolls. I believe in diversity. Let's talk business. Oh, great. Sounds boring. Sounds dull and lame, but I guess, I guess we're going to talk business. The Cube. Well, it appears you've conquered the city, but how long can the truce last between your seven tribes? What will happen when each tribe returns to their homeland? How long until you are warring amongst yourselves? What you need is a symbol of this accomplishment. And here at Q Incorporated, we have just the ticket. We have studied the fleecy boxes in each of your layers and approved upon that design. In the basement of this very building, you will find a new and improved fleecy box prototype. I call it the cube. By installing one of your wool here and claiming the city as a new layer, you will cement the truce between the tribes and can rally around this as your new troll capital. Please go and see for yourself. I've even devised a foolproof locking mechanism. Once your wool is installed, no one will ever be able to breach the cube. Consider this a gift toward the new troll slash pumpkin partnership. Wait. When do we partner with the pumpkins? I don't recall this, but I'll take it. You know, if you're going to be nice to me, I'll be nice to you. Good day, sir. Right, so it's said in the basement. This has got to be basement, right? Puzzle branch, labyrinth branch. Where's the basement branch? Puzzle branch, definitely. This is... Don't shoot! I'm just a lab assistant. What am I going to shoot you with? I've got a sword, dude. I've got a sword. What's this guy doing? Is this even a guy? Street lamp model six. I was just talking to a lamp. Now I feel like an idiot. Survival branch. All right. Where's the basement? I just want to find the stupid basement. Is it this hard? Is it really this hard? Oh, here's the basement. Oh, actually, I thought I was going to have to bust through here, but this, this is the true basement. All right, where's the cube? Seriously, where is it? Wait a second, is this the cube or is this the prison? Please tell me I'm in the right place. This isn't going very well, is it? Do I have a pickaxe in here? That would make my job so much easier. Nope, we're just gonna bust it down with my sword. Wait, it looks like there's a way to open this thing properly, but... I mean, come on, what is it? wonder if there's a hint of this puzzle somewhere in the, uh... The puzzle room. The puzzle branch. Let's see if there's anything relating to those colors. Uh, and wait. Wait a minute. Five blocks. I've seen one with three blocks. There's yellow fifth. Then what about... There's definitely something fishy. There's definitely something weird going on. I could feel it. Brown is two. Purple is four. I gotta write this down. I got this. I'm opening this le the legit way. All right. Blue. Then brown. Then, um, then green. Then purple. Then yellow. Then red. Yeah! I did it the legit way. I didn't cheat. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I think this is time for a victory dance. 
Okay, let's do this. Victory dance, victory dancing. This is horrible. Remind me never to do that again. But this is the cube. Your wool will be safe with Q Incorporated. The cube, fleecy box 2.0 design by Q Incorporated. And I have the orange wool right here. Put it right in. And now, what is going to happen? Ah, we got the chest. We got a whistling talisman. And the fishy shaman. I have no idea what that is. But we're going to find out. With the orange wool secured, Yondu instructs you to take his talisman into the city and find a shaman near the fish market. Show him the talisman and he will summon a portal to the next troll tribe's lair. Okie dokie do, I think I can handle that. Congratulations, Ravager. Now continue your mission. Oh yeah, I got a promotion. Woo! Good times. Okay, so that opens the door again. Instead, I need to take... Um... The whistling talisman? Yeah, I need to show the talisman to the shaman, and then he will summon a portal to the next troll tribe's lair. So I need to now get out of here and figure out where the heck that guy is. So we'll see how this goes, but I can now actually leave this place properly. That is, if I remember where the door is, which I do, like a complete pro. Alright, let's see if we can find this shaman dude. There's some people over here. Do you think this is him? He's riding a unicorn. I mean, that's pretty, it's pretty eccentric. So it's got to be the guy. Watch the hooves. Surrender and give up your steed. Um, let's see. One of you and five of them, not four. I think they've got it covered. They don't need my help right now. Now, where is this fishy shaman guy? I have no idea. Where's the stupid fish mark? Now, wait just a minute. I remember seeing a bunch of fish somewhere. Over here, wait, is this the fish market? This looks fishy. Gigas Fish Market. Perfect. I must have walked past it already. I know there's fish in here somewhere. Well, not those ones. They can't open. Free fresh fish. Cook daily for your convenience. Please only take fish from the bottom chests. Praise Gigas. I have no idea who that is, but it's all good. But here's the fish market. So where is the fishy shaman? He's got to be around here somewhere. Is this the guy? Is that you, shaman? Heliotrope. Who stands before me, courier or ravager? Prove yourself with this talisman, and I shall open the way to my lair. All right, I think we found the guy. One talisman coming right up. Boom. Oh, yes. Oh, no, we're going to the nether? Why would you do this to me, mate? Why must you send me to that fiery, awful place? Oh, boy. This is going to be a long day. Uh, right. Thank you for your kindness, sir. Heliotrope, man. Shaman dude. Thank you. Much appreciated, and farewell. You gotta be respectful of these guys, otherwise, you know, he might... might burn me alive or something. You saw what his friend with the red face was doing? He burned that guy alive. That's not cool, dude. Oh boy, I'm scared now. I don't know if I want to mess with these dudes. Alright. What's up? Welcome to the Heliotrope and the Lands Beyond. And there's a minecart, and I hear ghasts, and this... This may not be a very safe place. So, honestly, I think I'm gonna check it out until next time. I'm good. It's all good. There's... There's no need to go to the nether too quickly, right? It's not like we're in a really big hurry or anything. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to subscribe and leave a like. And hopefully I will be out with the next video in this series very, very soon. And if you are enjoying this, be sure to leave a comment letting me know as such. If I get comments saying that they really like a particular map or series or topic or anything like that, that really encourages me to do more of it. So if you are enjoying this and want to see the next video as soon as possible, be sure to let me know in the comments below. Also, feel free to leave a comment of anything else that you'd like to see me do, because I will try pretty much anything Minecraft, except parkour, because I've tried that already and it goes horribly wrong. So if you tell me to leave it, if you if you leave me a link to a parkour map and tell me to do it, you're probably going to regret it because well, it's not going to go well. But anyway, I'll see you guys on the next video and I hope you enjoyed this one. Goodbye.